After 5 a.m. here in North Conway, New Hampshire, at the uh, hotel, it's as per weather.gov. It's the uh, about 10 below zero right now, and we're gonna get ready to go up north to uh, see if we can get some minus 20 degree readings. Do we have the uh, thermometers? Nope, I was about to ask you that. All right, I'll run up and grab them. What? I'll run up and grab them. Okay. All right, so we're gonna turn this car on. <coughs> see how it goes. It's gonna be a very, very cold start, but let's see. You ready? Here we go. It says minus one, but it's colder than that. So it takes a minute for it to. Uh, temperature is minus 21 degrees. Car thermometer. <clears throat> so we uh, purposely drove about an hour north of where our hotel is in uh, from North Conway to Whitefield to experience this dangerous cold because who knows when we're going to experience something like this ever again. So minus 21. It's um, quite different. You walk outside, your hands start to, if you're not wearing gloves, your hands start to hurt pretty quickly. Your nose, your nostrils freeze up real quick too, especially if you have a uh, mucus in there. It'll freeze up. It starts to hurt a little bit. Um, <clears throat> no wind, so the wind chill is not, is, there's nothing really going on with the wind chill. But, um, aside from that, it's quite the experience. It's a pretty little town, as you can see. I'm trying to find a bank sign so I can get a few pictures in front of it to prove to my friends that it's actually minus 21. So, yeah, that's really about it. I think that the biggest change for me is when you breathe, it hurts. Yeah, it does. <laughs> but my hands and everything were fine, and so were my nostrils. It's a pretty little town. There's a bank right here, but it doesn't have a sign on it. 